What's up, guys? Welcome to my NWA Hard Times Prediction Show. We're about a little bit, uh, an hour away from showtime, so I was going to do a quick run-through, uh, make my predictions for each match. Um, first things first, uh, inter-promotional match between NWA's Nick Aldis versus Ring of Honor's Flip Gordon. Um, I'm predicting a big night for Strictly biz Business, uh, Nick Aldis's uh, new faction. So... Uh, Nick's going over flip today. Uh, it's going to set up. Well, there's a, there already is a setup between uh, Nick Aldis's Strictly Business and Marty Skrull's uh, Villain Enterprises. Uh, this is just going to uh, further along the story. Nick's going over flip tonight. I wouldn't be surprised if Marty got involved. I wouldn't be surprised if both factions got involved in this match. Uh, but I'll go over the my other predictions for uh, Strictly Business's big night tonight. Um, all right, uh, another match is NWA National Heavyweight Championship match. Champion Shooter Stevens defends against Scott Steiner. Uh, Shooter Stevens, uh, I don't hide the fact I love this guy. He's been awesome. This past week, him and the question mark teaming up against Col uh, Colt Cabana and uh, Ken Anderson, <laughs> the the, uh, the bump uh, Shooter took when he got hit with the... Uh, the, the Mongrovian uh, uh, thrust. Um, it, it was awesome. Uh, maybe maybe the bump of the year so far in this early year. But I predict uh, Scott Steiner to win by either disqualification or count out. Shooter Stevens will remain the champion. Uh, next up, uh, NWA's World Women's Championship match. Uh, Allison K versus Thunder Rosa. Uh, I predict a uh, title switch. Thunder Rosa, Rosa wins. Um, I, I'm, I'm tired of Allison K. I hate this whole storyline with uh, Molina and Marty Bell. Get the title off her. <laughs> Let, let's, let's go on to something else. Uh, triple threat match for the NWA World Tag Team Championship. We have the champions, the Rock and Roll Express, defending against the Wild Cards and Eli Drake and James Storm. Um, at first, I was thinking uh, the the tag team of Eli Drake and James Storm would win the the belts, only because it's two top talents and they haven't really been utilized to their uh, full potential. But I'm predicting a big night for uh, Strictly Business, so the wild cards are go going over. We got new champions. Uh, put it down, mark it down. <laughs> uh, next up, NWA World Television Championship Tournament first round match. We have Stim uh, Tim Storm versus Ken Anderson. I'm predicting Tim Storm to uh, beat Ken Anderson. Ken Anderson's tied up in a feud with uh, Colt Cabana, recently turned on him. Um, Tim Storm, he's the, the, the heart and soul of the NWA. Uh, he, he's going over. He's, he's advancing. Next NWA World Television Championship Tournament match, uh, Zicky Dice versus Dan Moff. Uh, Dan Moff's a guy that I got to uh, watch a lot in uh, WrestlePro. It's local uh, New Jersey promotion, recently signed with Ring of Honor. Um, I love Zicky Dice, but Dan Moff's a beast, man. Uh, I predict Moff to, to beat Zicky Dice, Dan Moff advances. The next uh, television uh, championship uh, tournament match, first round, Ricky Starks versus Matt Cross. Ricky Starks, uh, he's advancing. You know, they're, they're, NWA's putting a lot of time and effort into Ricky Starks. Uh, he's going on to the next round. Uh, next uh, television matchup, we have the question mark versus Trevor Murdoch. Come on, you, you don't you don't bet against the the Mongrovian Karate Master. The question mark advances. Uh, Trevor Mur Murdoch, another great match, but he, he's going to find himself on the uh, the losing end of the stick tonight. All right, then we have the the, the, the wrestlers who advance in the tournament. Uh, We'll have Tim Storm versus uh, Ricky Starks. Hmm. So this kind of throws things off for me. Um, I'm predicting, I'm going to predict Ricky Starks it beats Tim Storm. I have a feeling uh, it's, I don't know, uh, crazy hunch. I feel like Ricky Starks is going to turn and join Strictly Business. He's going to beat Tim Storm. All the gold's going on Strictly Business. That's just what my gut's telling me. And then we have Dan Moff versus the question mark. Uh, gotta go with 
Got to go with the question mark over Dan Moff. That will set up Ricky Starks versus the question mark in the finals. Uh, we already saw uh, they were hitting at it uh, this week on the NWA Power. Uh, Ricky Starks was dressed as one of the question marks uh, disciples, one of his students. He unmasked, hit uh, Shooter Stevens with the, uh, the wooden board. So Ricky Starks versus question mark. Ricky Starks going to you know, pull off something devious, beat the question mark. Uh, he's, he's with Strictly Business. That's my guess. Uh, and you have the question marks. He, he's a baby face. Everyone loves him. Um, and, and, and even though they boo Aaron, Aaron Stevens, Shooter Stevens, the fans love to boo him. So you're going to see a Strictly Business. Uh, <laughs> uh, I wouldn't be surprised if you start, see them, uh, question mark and Aaron Stevens. Uh, start the feud with Strictly Business, but the big feud is going to be Strictly Business and Villain Enterprises, and they need a fourth man, and that's why I think Ricky Starks is turning heel. You'll have Nick Aldis, the Wild Cards, and Ricky Starks against uh, Villain Enterprises, Marty Skrull, Brody King, PCO, and Flip Gordon. Who knows, maybe we get a War Games match. Can't call it War Games. WWE owns that now, but we'll get something cool. Uh, I'm hoping, but uh, that's my predictions. I will uh, make another video and uh, let you know how those predictions go, but I'm going to watch NWA Hard Times tonight. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks, guys.